Hey my squidlings, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing the cheap art supply challenge and I don't really have a lot of cheap art supplies, like just right offhand, I got rid of a lot of them whenever I upgraded and I kind of regret that now because I do wish I still had them. But um, I bought some Crayola watercolors which cost me like two bucks and then I bought some Crayola, uh, uh, what are those things called, crayons and that cost me about another two bucks. And I'm using um, Strathmore watercolor paper, which is actually really cheap. I think I got mine like $3 for a 12-page pack. And then I'm using just a rando cheap pencil that cost me like a buck. And uh, I do use a Sakura Jelly Roll liner, but those are pretty cheap as well. Um, you can get those for about, I don't know, like $5 for three of them. So they're pretty cheap anyway. And then I used one black Crayola color pencil. So all a bunch of Crayola stuff. And I know Crayola is not like super cheap quality. They're actually pretty good. But I mean that's really all I had available to get at the time. So anywho I just drew a um what's it called like a bust of a girl. And I just wanted to show you guys that you can make really good art or at least somewhat decent art with you know cheaper supplies. You don't have to go out and buy the best of the best. The only reason you would do that is for the sole purpose of having it last for a long time. Because since I use Crayola things, they're not going to last, especially if it's out in the sun. They're going to fade and stuff. So I would never sell this uh, if I wanted to sell it, which I don't anyway. But if I did, I would take like a picture of it or a high quality scan and then I would like edit it accordingly. But I would never sell the original just because it wouldn't last over time. But I think that's the only reason that they're such low quality or considered low quality because of the fact that, you know, they're not going to last over time. Whereas something like an artist quality, anything really, it's going to last you for years. So, but anyway, um, it's just a really simple picture. I, I think next time I do this challenge, I am going to do like a more diverse kind of bigger picture. I just really didn't have a lot of time because it's almost Christmas and I'm trying to get some videos up for you guys and kind of pre-record some things because I'm going to be really busy over the next two weeks. So, anywho, I really hope you guys like this video. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. It helps me out a lot. Also, don't forget you can follow me on DeviantArt, Page World, Twitter, and Instagram. All of my links are down in the description below. And don't forget to join our cute little squid army if you haven't already. And until next time, guys, toodaloo!